What's up everyone? It's Colin here on day 21 of my 30 day dating challenge and I just landed in Las Vegas here and I am extremely tired and uh, ready to go to bed but I just wanted to shoot this video before I did and I'm actually here for a workshop um, and uh, for my main man Steve Pavlina who's a personal development blogger who I've been following forever and I totally love his work. And uh, so I'm really excited about this. So this is going to be interesting because I don't think anyone comes to date anyone in Las Vegas. So uh, I don't know how I'm going to do that whole thing, but we'll see how that works out. Um, <laughs> I think I just have to like talk to a lot of strangers and see if anyone wants to like grab a drink real quick or something. Uh, I don't know. Anyway, but here I really, what I'm really here to do is like have fun and experience this conference and, um, you know, like live life under my terms, right? Like I've been talking about. So anyway, um, today I went on this date with somebody who I wouldn't normally have gone on a date with. And this was somebody who, uh, a girl who's visiting from Russia. And um, I wouldn't have normally done this because she's only here for like 10 days. And so obviously it's not going to turn into anything really. Um, and you know, what, what it means to the old version of me is that I have to put myself out there and potentially like, like, uh, gain someone's approval, you know, like that's the way the old version of me would have come into this. And what I'm really getting out of all this is that I am learning how to really like, I'm having tons of fun and I'm also, there's none, none of that's coming up for me. Like I'm not looking for people's approval anymore. I'm showing up and I'm just having fun for the sake of it, for the sake of the date, not to like, Oh, does this person like me or do they approve of me? Which is so different than the way I've approached like all relationships I realize, whether it's friendships or like, it's always like this question in the back of my head, like, does this person like me? Does this, per you know, like, and obviously like, I know a lot of people like me, but that's still there, especially when like dating, it's, it has been super lame. So now I'm just really like through this dating experiment, like getting, uh, able to just show up and like have fun. Like she was so adorable. Like her, she's got a Russian accent. That's um, you know, we have such differences in the way we speak and stuff. And it was just so much fun getting to know like her and her culture. And like, and we actually totally connected on, a, on, um, a great level. And I just had a blast with her. And, um, you know, I never would have done that had I not been pushing myself through this, this, um, challenge. So that was awesome. And I also, you know, noticed that I was a little afraid to tell her about the experiment that I was doing, but I'm practicing, you know, cause I still want to hang out with her. Like, while she's still in Portland again. And potentially if I told her, she could get like offended or something and not want to hang out. But, um, you know, I'm practicing like really just being direct and being totally open about where I'm at and who I am and potentially getting rejected when like opening up to people. And I did, and guess what? She was very um, intrigued by it and liked it. And I think we got, you know, connected on a whole nother level um, once we started talking about that stuff. And yeah, it was just great. So um, lastly, I also have been noticing that I'm actually having a much harder time talking to people now than I did in July. Cause July I was like, okay, I had my quota to meet. I go do it. Like I run a little bit, my little machinery, I go talk to people. And now, um, now it's like, I'm analyzing whether this is going to turn into something or not. But um, I started practicing going back to talking to people again. And I was in the airport going to Las Vegas and there's this blonde girl who's in a mini skirt and tall and like all the guys are looking at her and you know, I clearly am the one dude who's like walking across to go talk to her and I really don't want to, I'm like super tired, but I started to start getting in that mode again, getting that social, like meeting people mode. And I did it and it was actually, um, it was rad. It was totally painless. Like she was, um, super cool. And we actually talked for a long time in the airport terminal. And, uh, it goes back to another thing about, uh, context, which I learned in July about when meeting people, you know, the context, like we're all flying to Vegas. So everyone's like very social and probably will more willing to meet each other. But, um, anyway, the point being is that I'm still practicing, like getting over that, that anxiety of like, of meeting people on it. Cause it's on a different level now. It's like, now I, ex now I'm looking to like turn it into a date or something. So anyway, uh, whatever. I'm tired. I'm going to bed. Thanks for tuning in and I'll talk to you soon.